Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new video here today upon my channel guys. Today my friends and welcome to the Chainsaw Massacre technical test. And at the time I record this video I've got literally till midnight to record this video. And honestly, I'm excited. Yo, anyone can hear me? Meinen Sie die Dialoge, wenn die Charaktere zueinander sprechen, automatisiert? Das wäre super cool, wenn man deren Voice Chat abhören könnte, Junge. Das wäre geil. This game is well, guys. Oh, Just you want to know. Der, der ist, is scheduled to be krabbeln. released. It's got a planned release date sitzen. of August 18, 2023. Und and it will be coming out on the PlayStation 5, the PS4, the Xbox One, the Xbox Series S and X, Hello. and of course PC. Hello. Hello. Listen. I know my family can be scary at times. But I'm not like them. I want to save you, at least one person. All you have to do is fuck to work you. together with me. Fuck you! No, fuck you! Fuck Help you! Help to kill your friends and I will make sure you can escape! <laughs> I'll kill you! You fuck can't you. kill me! I'm the fuck bad guy! You. Fuck you! Okay, you're the first one I go for. Try it. <laughs> I will. <laughs> Yeah, you're the first one. You're on the first one on his victim list, bro. <laughs> Muerto County for University of Texas student. The sheriff's department says Maria Flores, a native of... So yeah, this game is still in process. Obviously, it's still in early development as well. And we're going to be playing as Leatherface as well, which... As long as I can at least like, get, like, one or two kills, I'll be happy with that. But this is just more about the show me gameplay on this, man. And just let me know down below in the comment section, are you going to be picking this game up and have you been experiencing the technical test so far? I mean, it's a little bit buggy, but at the same time, I've been hyped up for this. I just wish I had more time to play on it because I requested access for it, I think it was a couple of days ago. And then the last day of the technical test, which is today, at the time recording this video, it is like they've given me access. So I literally got until midnight. Yo, bro. We're leather face, man. I'm gonna test someone on a new one. That's, that's for sure with this thing. Obviously, as well, each of the characters have got, like, abilities and stuff. So, some of the stuff I do kind of know how it works. Like, for example, with leather face, you can break, like, certain obstacles that you're in your way. Um, and stuff like that. With some of the other characters and stuff, you can squeeze through tight gaps as well to go after survivors. And the grandpa that you've seen that pops up on the screen, if you collect these like blood samples that are located around the map, and you feed them to grandpa when he's hungry, he kind of gives you like a vision pulse ability, so you're able to like locate where the survivors are on the map. You know what I mean? So it's it's an interesting one. So all we need to do is just basically kill the survivors. And there's no respawning either, so if you die, you die. Um, and obviously, as the survivors, your goal is to try and escape. Man, this game's awesome. It's sort of like a uh, frame drop, though, every now and then, I've noticed. But still, this game is, this game is impressive, man. I'm just absolutely like gobsmacked that I got the opportunity to play it because I thought at first when I signed up to it, I was thinking, oh, I've seen people playing it, and I'm just like, oh, I guess I wasn't successful in the like getting the invitation to the technical test. And then I ended up getting my invite to play it, and I was just like, oh man, I've got like lack of time, but at least to get my opportunity hey, to play it. Hey, there's a survivor so. outside. What the heck, guys? She's right next to me. All right, I'm coming to you now, bro. I'm coming to you now. I need to find out how to get outside. I think, yeah, I think it's this way. So let's just try and lock down these supply, the location of these survivors. Hey guys, I found a survivor outside. She's right next to me. But she's making use of one of those objects our Boba has to destroy. I need the safe <laughs> I love this guy's voice, it's so cool. 
kind of reminds me of Rick Tolfin. Literally. Just, I get like, Rick Tolfin vibes on him. I hope you managed to get your revenge, bro. Like, I spoke to you with disrespect. We need to show him what the family does when they get disrespected. And I just hope whenever you guys see this as a video, I just hope that you all she enjoy, guys. She jumped down the well. She should be inside the basement now. Hello, Bubba. Thank you for destroying this shit. There's <laughs> a lot of, like, different characters they could include into this game. You know what I mean? I'm hoping they add Michael Myers into it. That'll be cool. Like as a DLC or something? Or Chucky? So I've got a little nosy around as well. Well, I kind of like learn the environments as well. I think there's like two or three maps that you can play during the uh, time of this technical test. I think it's two or three maps. It's what it's one of them. Well, I'm impressed with this. I think it is pretty cool. I'll definitely have to, like, play it a few times or something when the full game is out. If you guys would like to see more videos on this in the future, let me know down below the comment section. Let me know your thoughts and opinions as well. What do you think of a Texas Chainsaw Massacre game? thing is as well with how big these maps are as well it's a lot of places to hide if you're a survivor you know I mean you can hide in the tall grass there's a lot of like different pathways you can navigate between and all they need to do is literally is escape like they don't like if, as long as they play the cards right they'll be able to do it it's just like we've got to make sure we keep this guard up and loot everywhere I'm gonna go back inside the house. I'm gonna have a little nosy around in case I can see anything. One's upstairs. Baba, come. Okay. Right, let's have a nosy upstairs then. I'm gonna try and like check out all these rooms. That's sick, man. That is awesome. Let's go check all the rooms as well, just in case they're hiding anywhere. All at once is at least one kill. I'd be happy with that. Just one kill. That's my goal. Just try to get one kill. Oh, this is crazy. Yeah, I don't think anyone's up here. That's the back here. Right. I know what I'm going to do, actually. I'm going to check down this way. Was a survivor then. <laughs> grandpa is in danger. Oh, they're doing stuff to our grandpa. Stuff. 
God stabbing him! It's been immobilized. Yo, that's a cruel way to treat a, a, like a grandpa man. It's cruel. What did they ever do to you? Or then reveal your location. To be fair though, we, we should have really been giving blood to grandpa. So I kind of like, yeah, I've been failing on that part. Jump through the window. Well, let's go this way, see if we can spot anyone. I've got a feeling there's gonna be some people lurking around outside here. Don't worry, I'm taking care of the generator and the car battery. In case I see somebody, I will tell you. Okie dokie. I can see somebody over oh, here. Someone, someone. Next to me. I see him, I see him. He's going for the car battery. He doesn't know I've seen him yet. He will fall for my trap. Give me 10 seconds. I will make sure he dies. Right, they catch up to him. They catch up to this guy. He's oh, right behind the car. Side. I can smell his fear. Oh, he's running, I boys. He's running. Oh, he's running. He's running. He's running. Ah, oh, bad play. I got somebody running away from me. He's going for the well outside. Him? No, he's not. He's going for the sunflowers. Oh, I've just seen him. Just seen him. I've just seen someone. I don't know if it was the uh, survivor or not, but I've seen someone. Right, if you go that way, bro, I'm going to go this way. We can try and flank him. Oh, I've seen him, seen him, seen him, seen him. He's on the other side of the car. Leather face. Get him! Behind you! Yes! Yes! <laughs> Just in case you try to get back through. Oh, Grandpa's in danger. Yo. Can you see him? Oh, you go for him. Go for him. I'm going to try and corner him off. Way. Just in case he can somehow get all the way around. Has he got him? You guys got him? Good job. Nice. That was the guy who said fuck me. Eh, hey, fuck you. But look who got fucked. Haha, <laughs> good job. <laughs> you got your revenge, bro. You got your revenge. That's what matters. A big F you to him, eh? Okay guys, I take care of the, the generator and the car battery. In case I see somebody, I will I will tell you again. Good teamwork there. All I right. love you. Much love, bro. Much love. Right, I'm gonna go inside the house. I'm gonna have a little look a little, a little look around just in case I can see anyone. Because I've got a feeling there's gonna be at least someone maybe lurking around, possibly in the basement. Because if we're focusing all our attention outside the house, there's probably going to be someone inside the house trying to find an alternative pathway out. Because there's like multiple different ways you can escape. So, we need to try and find this person. Grandpa's power is increased. Victim detective active. 
detection active, sorry. Right. I'm going to explore a little bit more down the basement, just in case anyone's been down the well or anything. Just in case they're down here. But if you are enjoying today's video so far, guys, make sure you smash the thumbs up button and subscribe if you new would really, really appreciate it. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on the Texas Chainsaw Massacre game. On the technical test, that is. Like, I think this game's amazing. You know, I just need to iron out some of the bugs and stuff and improve on the uh, frame drop and stuff. But honestly, I'm impressed. Game's awesome. Right, it's gonna keep an eye out. It's gonna be somewhere around here somewhere, surely. Someone could be nearby, someone could be nearby. Powers increased, detection cooldown reduced. Come on, where's this person, man? Grandpa's hungry again? Bro, it's just eating. Guy's like literally eating the blood like as if it's a snack. You know what I mean? Just chill, bro. Right. What if the person's outside? Be outside. Uh, the door in the basement. Somebody opened the door and said the basement. In the basement? Could be in the basement. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Go, we're gonna stop frame dropping now. Come on. Go get him, go get him, go get him. Come on. The week, the week, the week, the week, the week. Go get him, go get him. I'm glitched in the wall. Bro, I'm literally glitched in the wall. I've fallen through the map. Bro, I'm literally under the floorboards. I kid you not. I'm literally under the floorboards. Why does this always happen to me? Like, when I'm playing Faters and stuff, I get literally stuck in things. Or I glitch under the map. Or I get on top of the map. This was literally intentional. Like, well, accidental, I should say. Not intentional. It's like, I am literally stuck. All I wanted to do was kill somebody. And I have ended up getting stuck under the map. Hang on, let me just type this. Right, so... Glitch on the map after I kill that person. Somebody fell for my I trip outside. Under the floor. Generator or car battery. Lol. <laughs> Bro, I'm stuck. <laughs> Help me. I wonder if I can, like, unglitch myself or something. Is there a way of doing it? To be fair, this would be pretty cool if we can kill people doing it. I just hope I don't get like kicked for cheating or anything. Like, bro, I'm stuck under the map. But anyways, guys, if you have enjoyed today's video so far, then all I ask is that you give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you new. I really, really appreciate it. It's been a lot of fun playing this. I'll try my best to try and record another video if I can, but if not, I just hope you all enjoyed this one and so we get a chance to probably, possibly, hopefully be able to play it again in the future. Anyways, take care. Hope you all have a fantastic day. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new. It takes two seconds of your time and it's for free. Anyways, see you all later. Take care.